Good morning everyone. So I decided to make a video uh, during this um, coronavirus quarantine um, situation around the world. So I decided to record my whole day routine to share with you what I'm doing every day. Because basically we're not really allowed to leave the house unless uh, we are going for a run or for a cycling. That's what government here in the UK said. So yeah, from the morning till evening, you will see today what I'm killing my time with. So let's go. As soon as I'm done with the breakfast, the next step is training. So I took some time, I wrote a full body circuit to complete my garden. I'm lucky enough to have a garden, I'm telling you that, because it makes such a big difference when you have a little bit of space outside of the house or apartment area. So I put together, I'm gonna start with the, with the upper body, into the lower body, into the core. So I'm gonna share with you guys what I wrote for today training session and of course if you have the the right equipment you can complete um, this circuit if not I also have a 20 minute uh, workout uh, plan that you complete at home which doesn't require any gym equipment you can see that uh, on my youtube channel as well all right let me share this uh, circuit I wrote uh, today so you can see exactly what I'm going to work on here is the garden circuit. We concentrate on upper body, lower body and core. Uh, we're gonna start with the upper body. So it will be pull-ups, decline push-ups and uh, tricep dips. So let's uh, start with pull-ups. Each exercise will be four sets and the pull-ups, eight reps. Let's say I pull eight reps because I'm adding an extra 12 kg kettlebell. So you'll see that when I'm going to perform the exercise. But if you don't add any weight, make sure you try to concentrate between 10, 10 to 12. Of, uh, reps decline push-ups I wrote here close grip because once you do a close grip or diamond push-up you concentrate more on your um, upper upper chest which of course you want to get that V uh, defined uh, so you can do that uh, I put 10 reps but I usually perform I say do between 10 and 15 I put 10 for beginners of course uh, triceps dips 12 reps of course, if you do with weight, if you do without weight, try to do more than 12. Uh, okay, lower body. Uh, lunges, split jump. You're going to do eight, eight um, lunges each leg of uh, four sets. Front squats. I have some discs in my garden. Only I have two of 20. So I use 20 kg. Sorry, two of 10. I use 20 kg disc to complete about 15 reps, um, 15 squats. Okay, now we're gonna go into the glute, glute bridges with, uh, with ball, so you're gonna do each leg 25 reps. Okay, and then core, we're gonna do hanging races, 20 to 25 reps, I'd say. Uh, crunches with uh, 10 ki kilograms disc, 20 reps. Russian twist with a 12 kg kettlebell, because that's the kettlebell I have in my garden. Uh, 20 20 reps so four sets as well so basically the idea is each each muscle group I mean each uh, body part you try to complete four sets with each exercise okay so basically I'm pretty much ready to go to start my training session but before I'm gonna start my training session I want to share with you guys what I'm taking in terms of pre-workout supplements so I'm gonna share all this with you uh, I'm gonna start with a green extract called spirulina. I don't eat enough of greens. I mean, I guess I don't eat enough of greens. So this is a great uh, green extract to, you know, replace the greens. Uh, the next one is L-arginine, which helps a lot at your blood flows during your training session. The um, uh, third one, it's um, Zinger, which is an organic ginger shot helps a lot towards your immun immun immunity system and I'm taking something for energy 
So usually I either have a cup of espresso or I have a can of Noco BCAA, which is high in caffeine, has about 180 milligrams per, per can. So I think I'm all ready to go now. I work in finance, God bless, no, this not by chance Don't dab me, you're not my man, don't at me, you're not my man Mama said don't buy it if you can, I buy it twice I cop by the tools and I don't pump fake with the price Always on the grind, I put in work with all my might I know that he got me, got me, got me, not by sight yeah. For sure though. That's for sure. Grinding from the grip, no shame, take a photo. Take a photo. Time to take a trip, we had north to the border. Say you feeling up, I'm my favorite type of harder. I got kids to feed, I got enemies, I got guys give, so they envy me. Got some friends out in Memphis like I'm Aubrey. Got some friends fall for orange like some autumn leaves. Yeah. Ladies and gents, so the garden circuit is now finished. Thank you so much for watching. I really, 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 really enjoy that. So the plan now is to grab a protein shake and then because the government allow us to go either for a run or a cycling session around the area we live, uh, <clears throat> training is not quite finished yet. So I love cycling, I'm gonna grab the bike and I'm gonna go for a quick cycling just to hit some extra, extra cardio. Why not? Okay, good to go. All right guys, now we finished the training session. Uh, I'm gonna make my protein shake and I'll show you exactly what I'm adding into my shake. So, we're gonna start with some uh, coconut milk. I love coconut, like it's my favorite. So we put probably half of that. And then uh, after we add the coconut milk, <coughs> we add a scoop of uh, whey protein. This is like pure whey. Whew. I mean, just a scoop and a bit, why not? <laughs> there it is. And then after that, we're gonna add a scoop of granola. Because it's high in fiber. Bang. And after that, we're gonna add a tiny teen scoop of L-glutamine. L-glutamine is perfect for muscle recovery, just to let you know. Here it is. <coughs> and then, I love peanut butter. As you see, I use this in the morning for my porridge as well. So we add like probably half a spoon of uh, peanut butter. Yeah. Mmm. Delicious. We shake it and we're good to go. It's time to shake. So we got the right amount of protein, the right amount of um, carbs and uh, fiber, and of course the L-glutamine, which is a uh, muscle recovery. Cheers. Hey, I remember lots of you they asked me about my diet situation and macros and all that. To be honest with you, I don't really count any macros. And I do snack a lot, so I have a sweet tooth. 
this is what's uh, next on my snack list um, damn I love pastries I love chocolate I love Haribo's all sorts but hey as I said earlier I'm about to go for a cycling session so that's gonna burn everything out and besides that I have a mad crazy fast metabolism so everything I eat is just goes bang 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 I never had a, a let's say a high amount of a body fat percentage always been super low since a very young age and never really change since a very young age and never really change so So I said earlier we are lucky enough to have the permission from the government to get out of the house and go either for a run for a cycling session and I decided after my training session in the garden to go for um, half an hour 40 minutes uh, cycling around London and uh, just you know just to move a little bit more do a little bit of cardio some extra cardio and just change the air um, rather than just like be indoors just like do a little bit of uh, movement uh, outdoors as well so yeah here we are so after a long uh, distance cycling uh, we finally um, we made the final point and uh, it's just basically outside my house where I live and I wanted to show you this beautiful view check it out hungry like angry hungry <laughs> uh, luckily I already pre-made my meal yesterday and I'm going to show you what I'm going to have for for lunch basically late lunch so check it out I kept in the fridge in a uh, clean foil so this up right so what we have here we have a um, oven made salmon which is rich in um, omega 3 great source uh, of um, vitamin for your hair especially um, we have a um, salad made from uh, avocado cherry tomato uh, rocket and spinach and also we have sweet potato made in a oven as well so this is my lunch basically so obviously I've, as we got so much time in our hands we're filming some tiktok videos but funny ones let's go Definitely got too much time in my hands uh, right now in this um, crazy period uh, filming TikTok, funny videos, and all that. But 
but uh, yeah, I'm having another snack now and I said to you guys I'm sharing my nutrition with you so I want to show you what I'm eating right now. So we got some uh, granola with uh, raspberries and yogurt and um, cheeky uh, skinny latte. So let's get this straight into my stomach. Whoa. Right, so after a long day of training, cycling, messing around on TikTok, uh, I am now back in my workspace for the next couple of hours to plan and organize what I'm going to do for the next few days because obviously I don't have my usual routine when I go out to take my shots of my um, outfit and all that. So I'm going to do some researches, what I'm going to do for the next few days, what sort of video I'm going to concentrate on to add on my YouTube channel and also my other channels. Um, and uh, of course trying to figure out why I can take pictures of indoors in terms of outfit wide so I can keep uh, inspiring you guys with my looks. So yeah, we'll see. Uh, and then I'm going to uh, chill in the evening, try to find a movie on Netflix or Amazon Prime and um, have a cheeky evening drink. Why not? Why not? Some whiskey or some wine or we shall see. It's getting close to the evening now and I decided to go to the store to buy some wine and or maybe some whiskey. No, I think some wine. I fancy some cheese and wine tonight and my friend Tom has been helping me a lot with the filming today. Okay, him is already corona, corona situation. Corona yeah. So I'm gonna treat him with some wine because he's been great. He's been helping me with a lot of filming and uh, we're gonna have a movie night tonight and some popcorn. I'm actually the popcorn king. I love popcorn so much. He's so addicted actually, you know? So basically we just arrived at the supermarket now and um, just to give you the idea guys, in terms of social distancing, this is what we're talking about. As you can see, everyone keeps at least like two, three meters away from each other. So, of course, the virus won't spread. The dinner is ready, grilled chicken breast with coconut rice and broccoli. So, I'm just about to have my dinner. And you know what, luckily I don't live alone. I live with my friend Tom and he actually decided to join me for a glass of wine. I told him, Murray, I'm gonna treat him. So, he's having also dinner. What are you having? Avalanche. He, are you on a special diet? Yeah, that's the diet. The COVID-19. Oh, is, is that like something really special? So yeah, we're going to find a Netflix uh, movie on Netflix or Amazon Prime. We'll see what we can find. What you fancy watching tonight? Scary movies. Scary movies. You know, actually last night we watched this movie. What was the, what was the name of the movie? Well, the yesterday. Yeah, yeah. Professor. Professor. The, the, professor, the, the professor. The professor. With who was the actor? With Johnny Depp. With Johnny Depp. It was so good. It's such a funny movie. I love Johnny Depp. It's so sick. Uh, so yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let me eat, and then we're gonna find the movie. 